In this quick tutorial, I'll teach you how to use your digital art application to save an image with a transparent background. This can be useful if you want to print something or place it into a different composition without the background filled in. Not all art applications support saving with transparency, but many do. To hide the background and make the area surrounding your image fully transparent, simply hide the bottommost layer known as the canvas or background by clicking on the eye icon. The checkered pattern you see represents full transparency. This of course only works if you painted your subject on a new layer rather than on the background. Next, you must save as a format that supports transparent layers, such as your art application's native format, or a PSD, PNG, TIFF, or WebP file. Otherwise, the background will be filled in with a solid color. If you have options for saving as PNG, be sure to choose the one that allows for transparency. Once saved, you can open a different document and place the file with a transparent background into it. You will likely need to choose something like import or place. You might even be able to drag and drop the file onto the canvas. You shouldn't need to do anything extra, but in Corel Painter, you do need to ensure retained alpha is checked or else the transparency will be ignored. If the image comes in with a background, then double check that you saved as the correct format. Otherwise, your image should look as expected. You can also save semi-transparent pixels in the same way and bring them into a new composition with that same opacity. When it comes to printing an image without a background, you'll have to consult the printing company's specifications. Usually you'll place your image into a template file, then upload it for printing. It's important to note that printing will make all of the semi-transparent pixels fully opaque, so be sure to account for that in your design. For example, if you're printing a sticker design, the design would be printed onto a surface like paper, which would essentially restore the background. Once the sticker was cut out from the surface, it would be without a background again. That's how easy it is to save an image with a transparent background. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. 